Pure Pleasure offers a proven sectional dock system that is easy to install, remove, and maintain. Its 100% aluminum construction is durable, lightweight, and will last for many years. Dished foot pads and leg bracing combine to give maximum stability. These are just a few reasons the Pure Pleasure dock system gives many years of enjoyment. Peer Pleasure offers three deck surfaces. All of these surfaces are removable. The vinyl decking remains cool on hot summer days and is slip resistant. The vinyl also provides excellent resistance to stains and is easy to clean and maintain. For the natural look of wood, we offer the kiln dried cedar panels. Our rigid aluminum decking has a baked on enamel finish with a textured surface. All of our attractive surfaces will give you many years of service. There are three pieces of information Peer Pleasure needs to complete your dock. The first step is to finalize a dock layout. Your layout may be modified easily in the future if you choose to add sections. Next, water depths are measured every eight feet from the starting location. Then, determine the desired height the dock needs to be off the water to allow for wave clearance on windy days. Inside each leg is a screw mechanism that allows for 18 inches of height adjustment. To install the Peer Pleasure dock, all that is needed is the provided adjustment crank and a 20-foot rope. Take your first section from the point at which it was stored to the starting location. The 4 foot by 8 foot section frame with legs shown here weighs approximately 65 pounds. Depending on the physical capabilities of the person doing the installation, the sections with removable panels can be installed and removed by one person. Attach the rope around the leg end of the section. Lower the section with the use of the rope. Once the section has been lowered, remove the rope. Two four foot by four foot panels are then set into the frame to create the deck. The panels weigh approximately 40 pounds each. The first panel is set into the frame and slid back toward shore. The second panel with holes is maneuvered up and over the leg adjustment hex cap and set into place. Take the second section frame from the storage area over to the first installed section. Stand the frame up vertically and attach the rope around the leg end of the section. Interlocking connections allow sections to lock together without the use of pins, bolts, or fasteners. Once you are ready to place your section, align and interlock the dock connections. Lower the section with the use of the rope. Keep constant tension on the rope until the section is completely lowered. This will keep sections aligned with each other. Repeat the process from the first section. Remove the rope and install the vinyl panels. After lowering the section, some leveling adjustments will be required. Level each section as they are installed. This keeps the sections going in straight. Peer Pleasure's adjustable legs permit leveling of the dock without entering the water. To make leveling adjustments, place the crank on the recessed hex cap. Turn the crank counterclockwise to raise the dock, clockwise to lower. There are no adjustment holes to line up, no set screws to tighten, and no chains to work with. This is another outstanding feature, which makes height adjustment a pleasure. Also, there are no dock posts above the dock surface, which maintains a clean appearance. Repeat the same process with each section. Align, interlock, lower, insert panels, and level. The optional wheel cart may be used to assist with installation. Attach the cart to the section frame on shore. Rotate the section onto the wheels and push the frame out to the next installation point. Install the frame with the cart still attached
and remove after installation. Place the vinyl panels into the frame. Once again, level each section as it's installed. Level indicators on each leg will show you when you have reached your desired height above the water. L sections are installed the same way. Align, interlock, lower, insert panels, and level. A corner section will add additional deck surface to the dock. To install the corner section, align the interlocking connection and lower into place. Dished foot pads form a suction to the lake bottom to form a vacuum, making the dock more stable and secure. Additional stability is given with our standard dock bracing. All sections are braced from front to back and side to side. This provides a secure feeling while walking on the dock. Once all sections are in place, add water to its tubular frame. The panels on the vinyl and cedar section may be slid forward to locate the water fill holes. The additional 60 pounds of water weight per section will help stabilize the dock during high winds and heavy wave action, protecting your investment. Accessories are easy to install. Their special design gives you the freedom to position them anywhere you choose. If you change position from season to season, there are no unsightly holes left behind. The aluminum vertical bumpers hold boats away from the dock and are easy to tie to. To install the vertical bumper, slide into position and secure with a single bolt. The aluminum swim ladder extends above the dock and angles out for easy use. Also, vinyl and cedar benches allow you to sit and enjoy the view from the dock. To install the ladder and bench, place in the desired location and bolt to the dock frame. Removal is another great feature of the Pier Pleasure dock system. There is no need to enter the cold water in the fall to remove this dock. First, remove all accessories and take them to shore. Second, drain the water from each section by removing the bottom plugs. With the use of the optional tripod winch, remove each section. The winch side shoe attaches to the side of the dock for removal of L sections. Remove the first panel from the L section. Connect the rope to the leg side of the L section and remove the last panel. Crank slowly to break the suction of the foot pads. Remove the rope and take the frame to the storage area on shore. Remove the corner section. Repeat the same process for each remaining section. The winch hook attaches to the center brace of the dock frame. Place the tripod on the preceding section of the one being removed. Remove one panel and connect the rope from the tripod winch. Crank the section up slowly and remove the rope. The tripod winch may be folded back and down, allowing you to step over it. If another person is helping, they may remove the winch for you before carrying the frame to shore. Repeat the same process for each remaining section. Remove panels, connect rope, crank section up slowly, and take section frame to the storage area. Store the sections and panels on shore from last to first. This way, your dock will be in the right order for installation next spring. If you have limited space or want to keep your shoreline clean in appearance, the dock braces may be folded down for more compact storage. You will greatly appreciate the ease of installation and removal of the Pure Pleasure dock system. We hope you can see the value in the leg bracing, the ability to add water to the tubular frame, and limited space needed for storage. Our unique design features make a Pure Pleasure dock easy to use and enjoy. Feature for dollar, we have one of the best value dock systems on the market today. We appreciate you considering Pure Pleasure. 
Also, we invite you to take a look at Peer Pleasure's full line of aluminum boat lifts. Peer Pleasure guarantees that you will be satisfied with your investment. We're confident that if you choose Peer Pleasure, you'll be glad you did.